guys, welcome back to BNB Wonder. So today I'm going to read you the book called um, Peanut Butter and Jelly. Well, it's Narwhal here, but they just crossed it out. And it's by Ben Clanton. So let's get into the book. Also, there's table of contents here. So, yeah. The first chapter. A sweet and salty story. Ahoy, Jelly! What is that smell, strange waffle? I mean, small, strange waffle you're eating. Num, num, num. Um, well, uh, um, Narwhal, this is not a waffle. It is a peanut butter cookie. Mmm, that's yummy. P nut but er. That sounds funny. What is it? What? You've never heard of peanut butter? Um, does it taste like a waffle? Um, no. Like strawberries, pickles, stir fried licorice? No, no, and ick. Maybe it tastes like um, stir-fried pickled licorice, licorice on strawberry waffles. Yuck! Have you actually eaten something like that before? No, not really. Actually, I pretty much only eat waffles. Phew. Wait a minute. Only waffles? You only eat waffles? Yep, that can be true. What about spaghetti? Spaghetti, have you, I mean, sorry, have you had spaghetti before? Spaghetti? Seriously, what about ice cream? Nope, that is just wrong. Pizza? Um, no. Mashed potatoes? Is that anything like mashed waffles? Mashed waffles? Um, really? You must have had something other than waffles. Cake, apples, cheese, pie, artichokes, marshmallows, guacamole, uh, sushi, french fries? Nope, nope, nobody, nope. Nara. You can just eat only waffles. Here, try this peanut butter cookie. Why? Have you ever heard of too much of a good thing? That's silly. How can you have too many waffles? May but maybe you like this cookie even more than waffles. Hee <laughs> hee. Good one, Jelly. Nothing is better than a waffle. How do you know unless you try it? Thanks, Jelly, but I think I'll stick with waffles. Just one little bite. I, I'll, I tell you what. I'll make you an extra large waffle You just if you just try this peanut butter cookie. How big would it would this extra large waffle be? Even bigger than you. She's thinking that it would be this big. Well, I suppose it wouldn't hurt to try a nibble. Hurt? Wait. Some people are allergic to peanut butter. You aren't allergic to peanut butter, are you, Narwhal? Allergic? Don't think so. But I knew. I but I once knew a seahorse who couldn't eat waffles. It was the saddest thing I've ever heard. Yet she swore she was happy so long as she could eat gummy bears. Okay, here I go. 
one teeny tiny taste. Nibble, nibble. So what do you think? Well, I suppose... Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. I mean, I went to the back. It's fantastic! So sweet. Nom, nom. Nom. So salty. It's yummy. Nom, nom. Smack, smack. It's crumb. It's crumb. Delicious. Nom, nom. It's yum. Delicious. It's... It's... All gone. Whoops. Delicious facts. Scientists believe mar narwhals suck up their food whole and eat man mainly fish. I prefer waffles and peanut butter. Mostly jellyfish sting their prey with their tentacles before eating it. Blue whales, the largest animal ever, Eat mainly tiny little krill. They eat um, oodles of them. As many as 40 million krill per day. Yum! Eek! <laughs> right there. Blub. Yeehaw! Round them up. Humpback. Whales work together to create complex bubble nets to coral fish to eat. Sea cucumbers eat all the sorts all sorts of things, including poop. Yum I've got a stomach tummy ache. Tiger sharks are often referred to as the trash cans of the sea because they will eat just about anything from pigs to tires to explosives. Yeah, explosives. All right, next chapter. Ahoy, peanut butter. All right. Alright guys, so I'm going to only do this one chapter and then the next time I'm going to do uh, another chapter. So thank you for watching, subscribe down below and bye!